All right, what is going on guys? Today I am super fired up as you can tell because I'm taking my baby, the CR250 two-stroke supermoto out on this racetrack behind me. I'm out here in Santiago at Santiago Racing Track. This is a go-kart track, but it's gonna be awesome for my first experience ever on a road course. Um, it's about 0.9 kilometers long, so it's really short. I'm probably not gonna get the bike out of third gear, but it's gonna be a lot of fun to just bang some gears and go wide open like this bike really wants to be ridden. And like I said, this being my first time, I'm gonna take it easy, not pushing too hard today. I don't even have the proper protection. I am borrowing some leather pants, but I'll just be using my cheap street jacket. So I do need to get a racing suit eventually for this. I'm so excited, so I'm gonna go ahead and get suited up and head out on the track and just do some warm up riding for a little bit till I get comfortable. And then we'll be trying to get some better footage and I'm gonna be trying to use my Skydio 2 drone to follow me for a full lap around the track if it can do it. Alright, here we go. First laps ever on a supermoto track. And I gotta get these tires warmed up first. And clear this bike out. God damn it! Forgot how hard it is to shift in motocross boots. There we go. out here for session two got a GoPro on the front here which I've never done before excited to try that but I can see it vibrating to shit already oh well gonna be working on my shifts they were so freaking bad last time
Okay. Woo! Got to take a break, but that was way better. It felt so much better. Well, it got cut off on that last run. So here we go, round three. have spun a few sessions now three or four I can't remember but I've done maybe like 15 laps in total and just getting more and more comfortable pretty much every time I go around yeah just working on leaning the bike over more getting rid of my chicken strips on the rear tire there I'm slowly working away more on the sides of my rear tire so I know that I'm leaning it more I can feel it more and just trying to be smoother all around the track just get my shifts smoother and working on my lines trying to go wider and cutting in this is my first time out here it's absolutely beautiful at this track behind me so thankful to be out here I've been through a lot with my knee in the last year and a half and just having a great day with my bike my knee has been hurting pretty much all the way around the track today, but yeah, it's still just healing up. It's getting better, making sure I don't crash today. And I'm about to bust the drone out here soon and try to get a full lap of me going around the track filmed by the Sky Dio 2. This drone is super cool and I've been wanting to show it off some more on the channel. So I'm going to go do that and just keep enjoying the day with the squad out here. connection was I going too fast yeah for it to catch up yes all right I'm gonna try it again okay hold on this is also gonna help all right we're ready right can you put it in front of me actually to the front it will figure it out once I start moving <laughs> <laughs> that is wild. 
Nah, I don't even trust that shit. No way, dude. It's getting so close. It's right there. Well, not that good, but... Well, the drone was a little bit of a failure and I was afraid that it wouldn't be able to keep up with me. And I don't even have my glove on. I gotta go back and get my glove. All right, we are back now. With both gloves. And these are gonna be the last laps of my day. Gonna enjoy them.
All right, boys. After any good day of riding, got to have a shotgun. Today we're gonna do it a little differently. Crispy, my boy Crispy, thank you for showing me how to do this. We're about to teach a lot of people right now. What you know about this? Yeah, cut that, cut that. 